My name is Daniel Vaswani, and I'm the lead attorney at Virtuoso Criminal and DUI Lawyers. Often when you pick up a DUI for the first time, it's a complicated process. It's taxing, requires money, requires time, requires resources. However, when you hire the right lawyer, they often take a lot of that stress off your shoulders. First and foremost, you likely have been served with a pink piece of paper, which actually effectively serves as your temporary driver's license. Most importantly, that document tells you that you have to contact the DMV within 10 days of the arrest to tell the DMV ultimately that number one, you don't want your license automatically being suspended, and number two, that you want a hearing so that you can actually defend yourself. And if you don't do them, your license automatically gets suspended or they don't give you the police report. It's really important to hire a competent counsel in this specific situation because if you do not satisfy that requirement, boom, that's it. Your license will be suspended and you can't raise any of the defenses that apply to your specific case. It's unfair. So often we mail things to you and in those mailers, we overload you with a bunch of information. The reason why that's true is because of these timely issues that we just mentioned. They are really important to comply with. In fact, if you do not comply with them, you are giving up a series of rights that you in fact have earned. On top of that, you're going to be inundated with a tremendous amount of pamphlets and information through the mail. Some of those flyers will be advertising SR-22. Question is, what is SR-22? Well, SR-22 is an additional insurance policy that you carry on top of your normal insurance. Question is, which carrier do you go with? Do you go with the carrier that carries your initial insurance policy or do you go with a different carrier? Now, a little bit more complicated than I already told you. You'll also be inundated with flyers and advertisements. And that mailer specifically tells you, hey, you need IID. When I say IID, what I mean is ignition interlock device. What an ignition interlock device is, is a device that installs onto your vehicle, which prevents your vehicle from starting until you have blown a clean breath sample into the breathalyzer itself. Don't get it yet. In fact, IID only comes into place in certain situations. Without qualified counsel, you don't know what those situations are. So you could be wasting time, you could be wasting money, and in fact, sometimes if you don't have the right IID provider, you could be messing up your car. So you wanna do everything that you can to avoid the installation of ignition lock device, especially prematurely. If you install it too early, it could mean that you have a lengthier time in which you have to keep that breathalyzer on your car. So keep in mind, without qualified counsel, these issues become tantamount. They become big, they become grander than they need be. If you're looking for an attorney to assist you with this type of issue, or you have any questions, Give us a call at 8336-NO-JAIL.